are doing business today with work rules that worked for a different time, that worked for an old work world. Are you experiencing a level of frustration, overwhelm, fatigue in the workplace? Consistently as I show up to our clients, I am finding time and time again that individuals are complaining and suffering from just total overwhelm and overburden. You know, I was talking this past weekend to my dear friend, uh, Peter Diamandis, the inventor of XPRIZE, the writer of the book Abundance, and just reinforcing to me how exponential the change is that's coming upon us today. And never again in history will the change be so slow. It's only exponentially going to get faster, harder, more difficult to keep up with technological change and competition. The frustration though, I fundamentally believe, doesn't exist because of that wave of change that we're faced with. The real frustration is that we are doing business today with work rules that worked for a different time, that worked for an old work world, that worked for a piece of change that was fundamentally different. But it's the work rules that we're clinging to of authority, of control, of the need for an individual to carry the burden of leadership and the position that you have. The reality is today, to meet the exponential pressures of change in the workforce today, we have to be able to reach much more broadly, much more inclusively. We have to be able to co-create solutions that aren't within our own framework of understanding. We've got to be able to reinvent product from the position of marketing, from the position of sales, from the position of technology, from the position of product development. It's a co-creation of all of those functions that will allow us to meet and exceed the expectations of the marketplace, the expectations of our customers, and the pressures of our competition. Now, how do you do that? You don't do that by clinging to the old work rules of, well, who's got the control here? Who is the authority? Who has the responsibility for this? The answer is no one, or the answer is we all do. And the question though is, is who is the leader? The leader is not the individual with the authority. The leader is the individual who has the capacity to harness the resources of all of those functions to move the strategy forward toward transformation. There's a different form of leadership needed. And that form of leadership is a word that I have felt we needed to create. And so I created it. I had been working and struggling for five years now on my new book and really questioning what was the angle of this new book. Was it a book about co-creation and, and collaboration? Was it a book on a new form of leadership? Was it frankly a book about how do we all grow and, and expand ourselves personally to meet the constant pressures for learning and growth that we have to achieve in organizations? And I realized it was a book about all of those. And therefore it wasn't just a leadership book. And it, and it wasn't just about cutting down silos. And it wasn't just about coaching and training and growth and development. It needed to be something new, a new space. The word I came up with was beyond collaboration. It was co-elevation. The idea that leadership today, without the authority in hand, means your ability to reach out to a broad set of individuals that are not under your control and authority and invite them in to co-create a solution, to invite them to find an answer that doesn't exist in any one of those pockets or silos, but an answer that can only be created with the infusion of all of those inclusive dimensions and collectively come up with a transformational answer while expanding our growth and development as individuals. It's a commitment to a mission and going higher toward that mission, but also a commitment to each other. This is co-elevation. It's leading without authority. Coelevation is a word that doesn't exist in our vocabulary today, but we had to create it 
for a new world and a new work order. A commitment to leadership without authority is a commitment to co-creating with a group of individuals what would meet the transformational pressures in the marketplace today. It's co-elevation.